Hi, my name is Mark Maurer. I'm an office broker here at Kimley and Haygood, and I'm going to discuss the 2012 Spokane office market and its forecast. Now, the Spokane office market is about 10 million square feet of space that goes from up north around the Y area division in Hawthorne to the south to 57th on the South Hill. To the west, we head out to the West Plains and Airway Heights, and our eastern boundary is Liberty Lake. Now, about 75% of that space is located downtown in the periphery of downtown or in the valley. That's where our high concentration of our office space is. Our vacancy rate for our entire market is 16.4%. And by vacancy rate, of course, we mean the percentage of buildings that are vacant. So in any building you look at, 16.4% of that building is going to be empty. Conversely, 84, 85% of it's going to be filled. And that's how commercial real estate brokers talk about a market's strength, is by, by vacancy rate. There are two areas that were particularly hard hit over the last several years. One is the Spokane Valley, where we have a vacancy rate of over 21%. Valley is an area that tends to feel any dip in the recession the soonest, and then is the last market to come out once the rest of the markets have recovered. There's a lot of excess space out there. And because land is cheaper out there, developers have built some buildings out there that's added to the overall vacant space. The Class B marketplace downtown also has been hit by this softening of our office market over the last several years. Two reasons for that. One is that some Class B tenants have seen that by paying just about the same as they were or just a little bit more, they could upgrade to Class A space here in our market. The other reason is that some Class B tenants, given the recession, have had to downsize or go away, go away altogether. So those two factors have, have hurt the Class B marketplace. Conversely, the Class A marketplace is doing great. We're only at 10% vacancy downtown, and that's nationally quite good. And if you're a five to 10,000 square foot professional service firm, a law firm, a CPA firm, looking for nice institutional class A quality space downtown or around downtown, you have only seven to 10 buildings from which to choose. We're used to other markets and brokers there telling us that they have seven to 10 options within one building. So our class A market is doing quite well. Large reason for that is we don't have the same level of merchant developers as other markets that are trying to time the market just right, build and then sell product. We don't have that same level of development activity here downtown. So overall, in a macro perspective, the Spokane office market since 2006 has become more weak. Its vacancy rate has gone up, and now we're at 16.4%. And it's likely that in 2012, that trend will continue, that we'll continue to have a softer market for landlords, and depending on the tenant, can be a tenant-friendly market. The reason for this is uncertainty. Until corporate real estate decision makers here in Spokane, CEOs, CFOs, uh, here, nationally, wherever those decisions are being made can reasonably forecast their growth needs and their employment needs, we're going to continue to putter along. And there's some macro issues at, at stake here, but it affects us down at the Spokane level. And until that can be reasonably uh, predicted, the market will continue to, to be soft. I do believe that in 2013, our market will recover and the, the biggest historical trait to, to point to is that we tend to lag behind Seattle by about a year. And Seattle this year has started to come out of its, of its uh, downturn. So 2013 could be more promising. For more information, you can look us up on the website at www.khco.com to look at our office forecast and all the other markets, our retail, our industrial. Or you can call us here at 509-838-6541. Thanks very much.